fascinating. Mm. Mm. Hello, Jane White, Deputy Head, Maker of Dreams speaking. How may I help you? Oh, it's you, is it? What do you want? He's not meant to be here for another hour. <sighs> okay, okay. I'll just have to cancel my Tai Chi and, and come over. Uh, but just tell me one thing. They've gone, haven't they? They have 100% definitely gone. Good, I'm on my way. Oh, Sir Peregrine Vandenburn, Mayor of Vila, what a pleasure it is to welcome you back to Beausoleil. As Mayor of Villar, I must be absolutely assured that there are no Grad 12s on the premises any longer. Do I have your guarantee? I can give you an absolute guarantee, Sir Peregrine, that, that all the Grade 12s have left the premises. I very much hope so. Shall we go in? Добро пожаловать в чем могу помочь? It's just through. I, 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 I think we can do that later. Let's go straight for the rapid test. Which nostril? Are you sure she was a medical professional? She seemed more like a grade 12. No, 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 that is impossible. There is no possibility of that happening. What we need is a nice cup of tea. It's this way. <laughs> And I've saved the best till last, grade nine French. Mrs. White, how lovely to see you. Hello, welcome to the uh, key channel. Please. Oh, I, oh, oh my, I have just had the most terrible dream. We need transfer to the hospital.
Grade 12, I've been expecting you. Hello everyone. This is not the graduation, and therefore this is not a graduation speech. But you are the graduating class, and we want to celebrate that with you. So you are all very welcome today, wherever you are in the world, to not yet the Beausoleil graduation 2021. A celebration of the class of 2021. I hope you will find much to entertain you in our celebration video and I hope it will whet your appetite for the graduation to come in the future when the Swiss authorities can be persuaded to relax the border rules and allow us all to celebrate in style with you and your families at Beausoleil. So welcome to not yet the Beausoleil graduation 2021. Ada, cheerful and diligent. Ahmed, influential, warm-hearted. Aina, proactive, conscientieuse. Alejandro, independent, athletic. Alexander, hardworking, dedicated. Alice, artistic and versatile. Alina, determined and active. Alyssa, dedicated and sociable. Amina, enthousiast, attentionné. Anastasia, determined and creative. Ariana, travailleuse acharnée, intelligente. Benny, principled, hardworking. Boris, humorous, thoughtful. Shari, sociable and spirited. Daria, independent and easygoing. Dennis, ambitious and classy. Denizan, créatif, élégant. Dion, mystical, charismatic. Ea, Enthusiaste, collaborative. Edwardina, creative and kind. Emalou, talentueuse, toujours de bonne humeur. Jerry, well-meaning, intellectual. Grace, dynamique, sociable. Hubert, independent, focused. Ilona. Communicative, amical. Yvonne, gentlemanly and loyal. Jad, kind, good humored. Javier, bright, stylish. Jonas, thoughtful, courteous. Julia, outgoing and passionate. Kate, Courageous and original. Kathleen, gentille, drôle. Kebir, extraverti, loyal. Kirill, independent, clear thinking. Konatsu, dependable and level headed. Lorenza, witty and self assured. Luca, Sporty and caring. Liaman, spirited, emotional. Maëlys, athletic, déterminé. Margot, ouverte d'esprit, compatissante. Maria, persistent and compassionate. Max, funny, lively. Miguel, Determined and empathetic. Melana, warm hearted and kind. Miranda, sociable, supportive. Morgan, determined, focused. Nico, 
warm-hearted, hardworking. Nikki, independent and easygoing. Noof, chatty, kind-hearted. Nozomi, well-mannered and hard-working. Pranati, reliable and caring. Kiran, dynamic, tall. Riza, humble and attentive. Rania, attentive, bavard. Riri, a team player and stylish. Rui, sociable and caring. Shariam, well-mannered, diligent. Stefan, dedicated, sociable. Stephanie, determined and independent. Takahito, level-headed, entertaining. Taylor, open-minded, funny. Thomas, sociable and athletic. Tricio, sporty and funny. Vinit, humorous, warm-hearted. Zaran, generous, caring. Oops. <laughs> Every graduating class of Beausoleil has a, a very definitive character and for you guys the word that really encapsulates you is kindness. You've gone along with everything that, that we needed you to do and you've appreciated uh, the things that we have tried to do for you. You guys always looked after each other, you always worked hard. See, sí, uh, bueno, han sido, han sido ustedes un grupo um, muy heterogéneo. Uh, Está claro que las personalidades quedaron, que las personalidades han sido bien, bien definidas. Eh, las ambiciones también. You guys are really a group that has always persevered, uh, even if it hasn't been perfect, and that's something that you know is a really important quality that I see in you guys. Yeah, no, you were, you were just so strong. I think it's just you know, and strong individuals. We were reflecting with Mrs. Tagbone what you might do, and you know, you and peacemakers came to mind award-winning architects, uh, you know, strong CEOs, uh, just, yeah, very powerful and driven, you know. Your sense of fun uh, was infectious. Um, I think Grace and Kabir in particular. Um, and actually it kept us, um, as the house staff, it kept us motivated to, to really keep pushing and giving back and providing with you guys with, with opportunities. And it just really uh, reinforced that sense of camaraderie and um, unity in our house. Thank you. Uh, I could think in particular Laman, Alyssa, Nikki, um, arriving quite quiet, quite shy, but within two or three days I can remember us being on the terrace, doing egg and spoon races, sitting around the campfire. I have an enduring memory of uh, Ahmed, hair streaming, glowing, waistcoat unbuttoned, like some wild Lebanese Gandalf enchanting all the ladies. And he wasn't the only one. Tucker, I remember, glowing also, ebullient, free from school, uh, enjoying the fresh air. There was Javier, um, who did a, a powder skiing trip with, with me and uh, some guides here, and we did an amazing descent from the Diebrae Glacier. It's just been an incredible roller coaster with you all. Um, you know, just love, just tears of joy, fun, laughter. Uh, what can I say? You've just been an amazing group. Ce qui va me, me manquer le plus avec vous, c'est votre bonne humeur. Que ce soit Aina, Grace, Kebir, uh, Margot, vous avez toujours le sourire, vous êtes toujours en train de, de, de rigoler, uh, vous prenez tout de façon ultra positive. Ce qui va vraiment le, le plus me manquer, c'est votre enthousiasme pour la vie, pour le quotidien, euh, votre joie euh, à, à passer du temps avec nous, à passer du temps à l'école. Euh, vous apportiez beaucoup de gaieté dans les couloirs, vous apportiez beaucoup de gaieté dans les classes. Euh, vous mettez beaucoup de musique très forte aussi, et ça c'était bien. Euh, donc voilà, vous allez, ça va beaucoup me manquer. Votre joie de vivre va me manquer. 
Hi, Aina, this message is for you. Um, I really admired your tenacity, strength of character, positive personality. You came to every lesson with a smile, never complained, and you were a breadth of fresh air. Uh, Dennis, big shout out to you, mate. Miss you already. And uh, 7.20 every morning, breakfast, our talks of sport, Bayern Munich and Chelsea. Um, so hopefully we can meet up in a, a World Cup at some stage in the future. Cheers. À Margot et Maïlis, et les remercier d'avoir euh, été mes tutis. Et aussi, je pense à Ariana et Ilona pour euh, nos cours de littérature. Voilà, j'ai d'excellents souvenirs de ces quatre jeunes filles et je leur souhaite le meilleur pour l'avenir. Mais je suis sûre que, où qu'elles soient dans le monde, tout se passera bien pour elles. Et ce que j'ai été tellement fier de vous, c'est que vous avez tous vu les opportunités qui ont été données à vous, même si ce n'est pas été le plus facile. Et je pense que cette résilience et l'enthousiasme et l'habilité de voir la positivité and to seize those opportunities will stand you in good stead for the future. So I wish you all the best wherever you end up in the world. I know I always say that Beausoleil will always be here for you. You have to remember though that Beausoleil isn't the building. Beausoleil is the characters and the people who are in it. So if you're missing Beausoleil, just look inside yourself and think back to your memories. I just wish you guys continue being the people that you are in every walk of life, the same caring, enthusiastic energy that you've shown this year and all your years in Beausoleil because we will miss you. I guess the main thing I want for you all is just for you to be happy. Um, I think to take away some great memories of Beausoleil, but to move forwards with your life and, you know, take things that you've learned, hopefully from us all, um, and to become real leaders in the world ahead. So I'm very proud of you and um, you were a great generation. Qu'est-ce que je peux leur souhaiter euh, Je peux leur souhaiter d'être heureux et puis, euh, et puis de ne pas nous oublier parce qu'on est, on est là. Euh, souvent, il y a, pour rire, ils il, il m'appellent il maman pour rigoler, mais euh, j'espère qu'ils n'oublieront pas leur, leur deuxième maman. Je vous souhaite un next stage, les freedoms qui viennent avec la l'école, explorer le monde, étudier, picking votre path. Je vous souhaite the best luck parce que vous êtes des people. Keep working hard, keep challenging yourselves, um, but more importantly, stay in contact, come back. Um, you're always part of the family here. And I really hope that all of you have the lucky breaks that you deserve and that your futures are really, really rewarding. And we look forward to seeing you back here in Beausoleil in normal times as soon as possible. Good luck to you all. You are wonderful and I'm sure you will go to achieve many fantastic things in your futures. Goodbye to everybody. Eh bien, à tout bientôt. Au revoir. Hi, I want to welcome you to the alumni community. Your Beausoleil family just got a whole lot bigger. You are now part of the Beausoleil alumni network. You're not just part of, uh, of, of things that have happened in this building, you're now part of a global network of Beausoleil alumni. Um, we have a great online platform called Graduate, where you can connect with each other and find other people. And one of the great features is an alumni directory. So you might find yourself in positions in the future where you can, uh, you can use this network uh, to reconnect with old friends or, or to reconnect with new friends. It's all about community and staying connected with Beausoleil and coming back and staying in touch with friends, but also meeting new people in the extended community. And as leaving seniors, you are now already, even just a few days later, part of that. Congratulations. So from today, you're part of that community. You are alumni. Story. When I came back in my room, these two were exactly like this in my room, and they were panicking and saying like, I can't get out of this. And the first time they showed me about him, he was just laying in the ground in the football pitch. So I was kind of like, I remember, I remember, I remember.
It was like the first days of school. He was just, they were like, oh, he was gonna be your roommate. I just see a guy like laying on the ground like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Where we started throwing eggs and shampoo and lotion on each other. The yeah. room was such a mess. Our goal was to build a, a boat out of card box. And basically, Nico went on it and the, I don't know, it didn't work and she just fell into the water. And, okay. okay, now you have to do my Thai movement, please. <laughs> this is not strictly Muay Thai, but yeah. Oh! Oh! Whoa, bro! So she did like a wood, uh, a wood carve. It took me 14 hours to do that on my face. On her face, yeah. You remember? Yeah, it was so fun. Yeah, his part, we're rapping it like over and over again. Girl, you know I got you, us, trust, a couple things that can't spell without you, now we on top of the world. <laughs> and they came back in, and I don't know where one goes in. They made like a laughing noise, and we kept on laughing the whole rest of the So yeah, it's Mr. Curry. Because it's Mr. Curry, it's <laughs> We're gonna miss you soon. All the challenges, we still like, had fun. We walked them all of them. <laughs> 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 and then we all just like we, we watch movies and he cooked us food and then we just started dancing and Nasty was teaching us some moves. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis, this one is for you. <laughs> so me and Dennis went on the expedition together and I think one of the reasons why I had such a good time was because I was with Dennis. Because I I would have a hard time and then it would just say like the most random things and I would just laugh, you know? Because he's funny, he's really funny. Give one of your friends a compliment without mentioning their appearance or physical features. <laughs> because this positive energy that comes out from you is just incredible. Oh, I've never met someone like Shyam. His way of thinking, his way of talking is completely different and, it, and I enjoy it because it's, it's funny, you know? Why, why it's something you, that I wouldn't find Why do you home. just say Shyam? I'm okay in him, but it's more special. I think he also spends more time in the in the gym than anyone else in the whole school. Yeah, literally. Like, he spends more time in the gym than in class. You know? No, I don't. Best parts of all of you, you. You're all like genuinely good people. Say two honest things about everyone else in the group. You don't have to be too honest. <laughs> <laughs> you inspire me because well, the things like you do and how you cope with them is is very inspiring. It's just like Nikki is like the best thing ever happened to me. A friendship wise, of course, Nikki. Sorry, nothing more. <laughs> She's like my sister. Neither of us have sisters, and we're like mm -hmm. we know everything about each other. Like because you're a good friend and you're always there whenever I need you. Yeah, it's like she always take care of me. <laughs> we were gonna cry. I thought you were gonna cry. <laughs> oh, I love you, Sherry, and I miss you. <laughs> I miss you. Appreciate that we met a long time ago, and she was like my first friend when I came there, and I'm super grateful because now she's like part of my family. What's good about Bosome is that it really, it really becomes family. It's just, it's, it's the boss of my life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we just understand each yeah. other and what we go through here all together. The community that the school has provides a lot of people to be happy. And people are just amazing here. Um, it says, what's the worst thing I have done at school? Wait, so this is a real camera? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what? I was like, it says like a prop or something. Why do they... <laughs> well, possibly. Do, do this, do this. No. <laughs> Bro, give it to me. Do a monkey flip into the swimming pool. I hope this 
is a good one. Did <laughs> you think I would do it? What is okay, it? Okay, it says call your parents and tell them how much you appreciate them. I'm gonna make you proud. I know, I know, I don't have any doubts in my mind at all. I know that you're destined already for greatness. Okay? Thank you. Peace. Good I think we can all agree in this Beausoleil, we all grew a lot. We learned a lot of things. If we would give an advice to the junior year, like, it's to enjoy this year. Enjoy this moment because, honestly, this moment is like, it's one of the moments. The moment in my entire life will never forget. Like it's just priceless. I think I'm very thankful to my parents that they put me into Bustole two years ago because uh, I just experienced so many different things and I had a lot of fun during these two years. Like wonderful life, so I'm not letting you go anywhere, even to Russia, just to forget about me. Love you guys. I can always rely on you guys, and you've made my time in Bustole memorable. I'm gonna miss boarding school. I'm really gonna miss Bosole and all the friends we made. I'm like really grateful to meet these guys because I personally feel they're the best. Just like I wanted to like thank you all to be my like for being here for me and being my friends and like supporting me every day, you know. When we became friends, it was part of the deal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like he's like, you can get rid of me. <laughs> yeah, I truly think that we're gonna be like friends for a really long time, I'm really fortunate for that. Yeah, now I even have a flag on my jacket. Yeah, it's, it's impressive. I will miss every one of you guys. Over the years to come, when life has gone back to normal and the pandemic is a distant memory, we will sit around the campfires, or possibly the restaurant tables, and tell each other stories about this rather strange little interlude in life. To borrow from Shakespeare, we will strip our sleeves and show our scars as we reminisce about a crazy two years of ups and downs that we shared together. We know that Beausoleil binds people together tightly. You make deep friendships and lasting memories. And I think, for many of you, the memories and the friendships will be deeper because of your shared experiences and triumph in the face of adversity. We are not yet far enough in the future to be able to look back on the pandemic and laugh. And I am conscious that there is still a long and difficult road to travel for many people around the world. And yet, even so, I can find many memories of time spent with the class of 2021 that do make me smile, reminding me what a great bunch of people you were with whom to share this particular leg of the Beausoleil journey. And I take all of these memories, my impressions of life with you, and I reflect on what they come down to. One of the characteristics of the year for me has been the need to call assemblies or meetings at very short notice in order to update people with a new twist or turn. We were planning to do X, but now we all have to do Y. I was always hugely grateful to you for the good-natured way in which you embraced the changes of direction imposed upon us. And I shall miss the cheers and the occasional groans when I explained that exiats weren't happening, or restaurants were closing, or on one memorable occasion that exams weren't happening. I remember talking to you near the start of the year, on one occasion in the school hall, when I had gathered you together as a grade uh, to cancel Zaran's grade 12 birthday celebration, I think it was. I told you then that I thought you were a really nice group. But nice is one of those words that English teachers don't like you using. It's not dramatic enough. 
and you have to use longer and more unusual words to keep your English teacher happy. Well, I like nice. Nice is about friendly, cheerful, good-natured, exactly the qualities necessary to make such a success of school this year. You are the kind of group who would cheer and smile and look encouraging, whether you were getting good news or bad, and this attitude rubbed off on the school. Actually, Ahmed normally cheered before he knew what the news was. You led by example. Oh, I, I don't mean that you always wore your shirt with your top button done up, or even your socks, or got to every check-in as well as you might have done, or things like that. That would have been too obvious, and you were above such trivia. Things that seem so important to us at school sometimes. Although Alex always dressed smartly enough to make up for all the rest of you. But you set an example in something much more than this. You laughed. You were good fun. You liked the school and showed it. And as a result, the school liked you. And we made it through the ups and downs of life together. This has been a great gift from you to the rest of the school. And you should be proud of it. It's customary on occasions like these for principals to offer wise words of advice. After all, you're about to set out on the rest of your life, setting sail from school and voyaging boldly into the future and the great unknown. And maybe I will give you a few more when you come back for graduation. But I think you probably know what advice I want to give you now, because it's advice you've been following by instinct, shaped, I hope, by your time at Beausoleil, and it's been serving you well. Keep being yourselves. Lead by example. Be genuine. Be cheerful. Be nice. The world will be a better place because of it, and you'll enjoy the ride. See you soon back here at Beausoleil.